um, days after accusing the BJP of a failed poaching bid, the Telangana government has informed the High Court that it has withdrawn the general consent given to the CBI, a central probe agency, to probe cases in the state. This is not the first state to do. In fact, states like Kerala and West Bengal ruled by you know, the opposition parties as such are other states that have earlier withdrawn their general consent against CBI probing cases. Uh, Uma joins us for more on this. Uma, again, a significant move uh, by the Telangana chief minister when it comes to state versus centre politics. Several states have in the past also done this. Sneha, this is not a uh, uh, you know development that's happened post this uh, poach gate, as people are referring to uh, the case of the Cyberabad police alleging that uh, the uh, three uh, so-called brokers, as uh, in fact the chief minister called them Delhi brokers, attempted to poach the MLAs from his own party. This is something that the government did in the month of August. That's when they had withdrawn the voluntary consent of the state to allow uh, a CBI probe to be conducted inside the state of Telangana, as you rightly pointed out. States like West Bengal and Kerala have done that uh, in the past as well. In fact, in many of his public meetings, see, uh, the chief minister has dared the centre uh, to carry out any kind of a CBI or an ED or an IT kind of a raid on his party. In, in that sense, even as his party is kind of uh, angling to take on a uh, uh, political role at the centre <coughs> by one, a name change and also saying that we are now going to go national. It is at this time that uh, this uh, development comes or being noticed that uh, the Telangana state had also withdrawn such a notice that was given. The election commission is also something that uh, Ch Chandrasekhar Rao, the chief minister, made a reference to, right. saying that uh, the Ma Munugod in charge campaign manager, Minister Jagdish Reddy, was, uh, has been in fact barred from campaigning there for the next 48 hours from 7 p.m. yesterday. And he said that that is something that uh, he, he saw it as a, as a kind of a ploy uh, by the BJP to keep him away. Of course, on its part, uh, the BJP has also gone to the election commission and as you were pointing out earlier, the uh, TRS has also complained to the election commission about uh, allegedly 5.22 crore rupees being transferred into 23 bank accounts and alleging that that is meant for distribution in Munugod. Of course, uh, right. the run-up to Munugod seeming very, very, very uh, fiercely fought and also possibly that a lot of money distribution is uh, suspected that will it will be uh, distributed there.